Hey there YouTube. Hey, sorry guys. I haven't been like uh, super super active. I've been trying to move and uh, between weather and everything else it's been pretty crazy. But I'm going to show you a quick one right now. What we're going to do is uh, we're going to do butt joints. Um, and I've got some really really thin material. Um, it's 18 gauge. So um, what you're going to see is kind of a different technique I'm going to use. So uh, the pieces are clean. They're just butted together. Um, and what you're going to notice is, you know, what I'm going to do is instead of trying to run a bead along um, along the joint, what I'm going to do is I'm going to, okay, it's going to kind of make it look like a TIG weld, which is cool. You're not going to get so much buildup, and it's also it's a really good way to make sure that you're not melting through because you can keep an, you can keep an eye on it. What I'm going to be doing also, you'll see, is I'm going to I'm going to push the puddle this way so I can kind of see where I'm going so that I can make sure that I stay on the joint. The other thing that we're going to talk about um, is you're going to notice that when I'm when I do this I'm going to show you my heat settings. I, it's really hot and I'm using a lot of wire speed and I'm doing that so that um, it hits it, it melts and does it quick. You know a lot of times like with with butt joints and things like this we're working on real thin material uh, the, the tendency of, of people sometimes is to turn everything way, way, way down, and then you got to spend so much time on the material before it actually grabs and melts that you just overheat everything and everything goes to crap. But uh, anyway, here enough talking. Let's go. Sh let's go uh, see what this looks like. All right. So this is what I'm working on. It's just a little thing, but uh, all we're doing is we just have some 18 gauge, and we're gonna just weld up that seam and you can see here this is what I've been doing and it looks fine and on this side you can see you got some kind of you got your penetration right um, I was also doing that same thing on these joints you know back there you can see that so it's nice and clean nice and easy um, I'm using the good Miller and there's my settings Okay. Like I said, I know this seems a little hot, but um, it just grabs, it grabs real good. So we're going to be going here, and we're going to be going this way. And like I said, I'm going to be doing, right? All right, you'll see it and hear it. Let's see if I can. All right. So here we go again, right? The three big rules. We're gonna get close, we're gonna go slow, and we're gonna relax. There's nothing around here that can catch fire. Okay, so see my angle, here we go. And there you go. Alright. On the inside, obviously, I got plenty of penetration. I can grind that all down. But I didn't have any melt through. I didn't have anything go through and have it all drop out. Alright, I hope you learned something. Uh, so again, right? Butt joint, nice tight. Of course, the material's all clean. No rust. Everything's all set. Um, as tight as you can, you know, you got to practice a little bit, um, but I'm telling you that, that, that pulsing technique, you got to try that. You got to try it out. So, uh, hey, subscribe and, uh, we'll do more here real soon. Thanks for watching.